So today, I'm finishing up the installation of my blackout cellular shades on the window van. Check out what I've done so far. The van is a mess right now, but show you the progress. So I have all the uh, overhead cabinetry down above the two windows that I'm installing. Um, you can see on this back window, I have the shade already mounted. Here, I got the uh, the brackets shown. These are the the stock sized brackets that come with the shades. They also come with extensions, but these are just the regular. Um, they mount pretty much perfectly um, in this little lip, this box support above the window. And the only thing you gotta be concerned about is when you mount them, to make sure that they're completely flush. You know, you don't wanna you go back too far and this starts coming down by being pushed against there, um, the little clip won't engage with the shade itself. So, uh, got two up above there, four above the back window, and I'll show you how well they go in. With the shade mounted, um, you can see there's a slight protrusion, um, from the top of the shade to the wall. But uh, this part doesn't really matter because it's uh, set back from kind of this main framework. And that's where my wood trim is gonna be mounted and come out. So um, I'm insulating in there for now, get it a little blocked off. Um, so I'm gonna do a wood trim out of plywood that comes up, comes up and across and down. And it's actually gonna overhang the shade a couple inches so that um, it keeps the shade in like a little track as well as blocks any light that might kind of creep around the side of the shade. Um, and then of course that piece is gonna come up and over and actually extend all the way up. So we got the plywood trim in. The back is cut out of one piece of four by eight. Um, just trimmed around the, the exterior to fit. And then big old rectangle cut out for the shade in the middle. And then this piece cut out of a single piece, um, except there's no connection down on the bottom. Just because how the window is set up against, kind of right up against the counter. So kept it open so the window shade just comes all the way down right to the counter. And here's the final product. So the bed back in. I'm seeing it kind of cramps on the window a little bit, but it's all good. Side. Looks pretty good to me. Pretty functional. Pretty nice. Here's an outside view. Um, so the slider door does not have any shade, obviously. And you can see the blackout of the side. So the shade is down. And I got all the lights on inside. And there is literally zero sign of light coming through. Um, I had reflectic shades up before. And there's a little bit of sign of light you can kind of see, so it's kind of nice now. Uh, you can't see anything. Complete blackout.